you can count on. KOMU 8 News starts now. Missouri Democrats are not happy with Governor Parson's appointment of Mike Kehoe as Lieutenant Governor. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jim Ray. And I'm Emily Spain. A new lawsuit against the governor argues Parson did not have the authority to fill the position. Tonight, the governor is responding. KMU 8's David Estrada is here in the studio with more on what both sides have to say. Emily and Jim, the Democrats say Parson should have let voters decide who should be the Lieutenant Governor instead of just picking Mike Kehoe himself. Both sides voicing strong opinions and Democrats taking the debate to court. Both Governor Mike Parson and Lieutenant Governor Mike Kehoe appear confident on Monday. This is why I believe it is necessary and within my authority to appoint the next Lieutenant Governor. Several previous governors uh, think that this is a position uh, that the Constitution not only outlines for him, but the, that he should do. But now Democrats say otherwise. I think anybody that's elected official or anybody that's going to be over the populace should be elected by the people who they're going to govern. A new lawsuit highlights a Missouri statute referencing specific time. It reads, whenever a vacancy in any state or county office originally filled by election, other than the offices of lieutenant governor, state lawmaker, or sheriff, the vacancy shall be filled by appointment by the governor. Governor Parson responding to the suit saying in a statement, the state constitution is clear in granting gubernatorial authority to fill the vacancy of lieutenant governor. Governor Parson goes on to say former governors on both parties have said the same thing, but plaintiff Daryl Cope says they need to reconsider. I'd say they need to look at the constitution again. The governor is confident the judge will uphold the appointment of Mike Quijo. In the studio, David Estrada, KOMU 8 News. The St. Louis Post-Dispatch report. KOMU 8 News.